Muffin from Mars? This is Muffin from Mars. Muffin from Mars. So Mr. R versus Muffin from Mars. Lucas versus Krom. So, well, let's get back into the match. Let's get back into that mentality. So, Krom, so Mr. R on the Krom can do pretty well. Great confirms off of everything and we're seeing right now. Already starting off with 54 damage right off the bat. And Krom and Roy have that confirmed with uh, with the uh, jab, right? It's jab into bear, right? Jab into bear? Jab bear, he, because of how his vouching works, he can get, um, he can even get jab forward smash. It depends on how his opponent DIs. Um, Sword character is really good against Lucas as well. Mm -hmm. um, even though uh, I feel like, no, I know that the PSI. And there we go. Yeah, That's the, exactly what we were talking about. The yeah, jab into the bear. Such a great Yeah, Psy, Psy kids really suffer against sword characters. I mean, most children would suffer against the sword. Yeah. I can't. Well, I will not confirm like why I know that, but. <laughs> I just saw your. Okay, eye, hold bro. up. Wait. Wait, wait. 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 Bring it back. <laughs> This set, this, this man. Okay, okay. He got, he got the down smash. Well, yeah. Bring it. Most kids suffer against. So how do you? What do you mean? Isn't that just common knowledge, right? I mean, common knowledge. But yeah. why, why do you sound like you've actually done it yourself? <laughs> I, I don't like. I don't normally feel too safe, but I feel less safe L than listen, I normally Listen, do. listen, <laughs> listen. My lawyer has recommended me not to confirm off of that. I. So let's just keep casting, <laughs> and you keep forgetting. <laughs> I don't know if I can. Man. <laughs> All right, so, um, so there is a lot of debate between Krom and Roy. What's I your take on that? I feel like Roy. Roy? I feel like I feel like Roy's better. B is it because of his recovery or the sweet spot mechanic? Uh, both. Both. Um, Krom, Krom can suffer from killing, but he can also be more reliable in killing. Mm -hmm. Again, depends on what you're doing with Krom, what you want with Krom. Krom has a lot more damage output than Roy, oh, but God. Roy has a lot more. Uh, kill potential uh -huh. since simply because of uh, Binding Blade's sweet spot. Yeah, and as well as uh, Roy's, Roy's Dancing Blade is one of the best. Yeah, it's, it's the best one out of the sword characters. It, it's uh, Double Edge Dance is the best variation. Uh huh. Uh, Roy's Double Edge Dance yeah. is the best variation simply because of his sweet spot mechanic. Uh huh. Everyone else has really bad hitboxes yeah. with theirs. Just kind of just doesn't connect. Uh huh. And it kind of also doesn't reward you anyways. Oh, hit some with the online special. Yeah, you just can't avoid that. Yeah, you, really. there's there's nothing you could have done. So Mr. R, playing a little bit backwards. So, th like we said before, this is really a big disadvantage for the the kids the, against the sword, especially. Yep. Uh huh. So, going after that one. Uh, Muffin from Mars isn't wasn't doing too bad, but I feel like that. Mr. R had a hard time coming back from that one because he made a few mistakes and ate a bunch of damage, but now this is exactly what we want to see. Pressure so much, and Bates out the options. We're seeing that. Tried to read the roll, but the, the get-up attack was what he saw instead. So going on from here, Lucas. Okay, Lucas in this game, is he better than Smash 4, or is he worse? Better. Better? Because I think one of the arguments that people tried to make is that he doesn't have those gra this, this grad combos, right? But he's got better options yes. in this game rather than 4. He has better kill power, better burst options. Uh, a lot of things that Lucas uh, really depended on in Smash 4, he doesn't really need in this game anymore. Uh -huh. Simply because he can get what he, he can get the kill on his own. Just turn around for the roll. So yeah, uh, he was out of perfect spacing. Uh, he was out of the range of uh -oh. get up attack and jump fair, and he can just react to what. Uh, so Mr. this is Mars this is still possible for Muffin though. Oh like, yeah, they're both at pretty even percentages, oh, uh, and it's the back air. Hit. Yeah. Gets hit up. That was much closer than I would have wanted, though, for Mr. R. That, that seemed to get a little closer than, than I would have liked, but... Yeah, again, uh, Muffin from Mars has to deal with a lot of swords down here in SoCal. So he's got some practice under as well. Yeah. Like, Espec especially, uh, I think he fights Valadin a lot oh, in, okay. uh, in hats. And Valadin being a sword player, he just, he just knows how to weave around the sword, uh, <laughs> swords a little bit better than other Lucas's do at this current moment. Yeah, and also Lucas isn't too of a common character that you see, especially yeah. in high-level play. There, yeah. There's a lot of weaknesses that he has. He, he, that's from Melee. Like, the number one thing that all Melees realized were like, oh, his recovery is pretty garbage. And in this game, it's pretty exploitable. Uh, we didn't see Mr. R go out for the edge guards because kind of Krom has a hard time doing it. And he didn't really need to do it at all. Just need to stay on stage and just kind of get the one yeah, down from there. Krom, Roy, Roy can do it. Krom can also do it, but the thing uh, about being fast fallers with not too good of a recovery uh -huh. is that you, it, it's better just to down yeah. tilt. 
just down tilt the ledge. And ledge trap and yeah. wait for the recovery. So here we go. So starting off for it. I love the Zare. Get off the ledge of the Zare. And Muffin from Mars going to get those down tilts into there. I love, I love we're seeing a different game plan already. Instead yeah. of going for the usual damage, he's trying to get Mr. R off the stage. Because he didn't he didn't do too bad. It was really close, but Mr. R was able to really dominate the game. So going on from here, moving on forward, trying to get the grab down. A lot of jabs we're seeing from Lucas. Yes. And Lucas gets some decent damage off of his jabs. Mm -hmm. Not really... Not really... Oh. <laughs> right, there's not really much he can do uh -huh. in, uh, in burst range. Uh, in close range combat, so so jab, jab I Ooh, think is fast. That dash tip? That no, that was uh, sliding was forward tilt. Sliding forward tilt. There. Shut up. So moving no, on forward. It, it, no, it was important to point out that it was sliding. Because yeah, it was a sli it, yeah. Because if he wasn't sliding, he would have uh, just whiffed it by a little yep. bit. But gets it on forward. Realizing. So that was a good job from Muffin from Mars, doing a great job against Mr. R. But here we go. Mr. R loves it when you're at zero, because that's when he starts getting all the percentages yeah. off. We're seeing from here, and trying to get forward. So I'm seeing, I'm starting to see Muffin likes to do get, uh, get off the, get off the stage into the Zare. And that's what we're seeing uh, right there onto the shield. He he like jumps off the ledge and he gets the Zare off. That's what we're seeing a little bit. But yeah, Mu Muffin. That that's a thing that carried over from Smash Four, especially since. Um, uh, it's Ooh. a little bit different in this game though because you have to in order to get the uh, like the the instant fall down that Muffin's uh -huh. getting past the double jump in. Yeah. Uh, as far as I know. So right now Muffin it's it's a big disadvantage right now. Like he is. there's no there's no way of sure coding in. There what he needs to do is um, really bait Mr Mr. R into his zone. But Mr. R is doing really well at at keeping himself safe. He's landing with safe aerials, he's landing with reverse up airs. And he's punishing well as well. Yeah. Like up B out of shield is a really fast option on all sword characters and doing a great job going forward. Up air into bear, such a good combo. And the, the tilts you were saying, instead of going off stage, going for the tilts, yeah. trying to punish him up from there. And hits it up with the PK freeze, tries to wait out the air dodge, but just wasn't in range for that one. So this is where Lucas can shine, and especially in this situation, but great job at Mr. R. He's just on point with his punishes. Yeah, Mr. R. Very well versed in just waiting for those punishes there, especially after coming from Smash 4 Sheik. Uh -huh. uh, Sheik, definitely a really good burst character in this game, but Krom, just one of the better characters at getting the uh, better killing. Getting the better kill and oh. making your opponent panic. That's it. That should be it. Yeah, and hits him with the back air muffin. I, I, he had a. He was looking at Mr. R and wanted to hit him with the the thunder, but then realized he needed to recover, so he tried to curve it around, but yeah. ended up hitting himself. Mr. R takes it with a pretty good two. Oh, 